an area of confusion that comes up regularly in my workshops and consulting is the array of words that we use to describe two very simple statements about performance, current performance and desired performance. Some of the most used terms that describe uh, levels of performance like that are baseline, benchmark, target and standard. People use these terms interchangeably and often they can't provide a definition of what each of them are to discern them from one another. So let's do that discerning right now and prevent time-wasting debates and misinterpretation from getting in the way of your performance improvement. So what is a performance baseline? Well, the definition of baseline is provided by dictionary.com and it is a minimum or starting point used for comparisons. A baseline for your performance measure or KPI is the average level of performance that you are currently at and that you'll compare future performance levels with to test if performance is changing. In an XMR chart, your baseline is the central line. A single value of your performance measure is not enough to act as your baseline because you'll end up mistaking the routine variation in your measure for change, and it isn't. So what is a performance benchmark? Dictionary.com again defines benchmark as both a noun and a verb and both are useful for understanding how this term applies to performance measurement. As a noun, a benchmark is a standard or point of reference against which things may be compared or assessed. As a verb, benchmark means to evaluate or check something by comparison with a standard. For example, we are benchmarking our performance against external criteria. Benchmarks in performance measurement typically come from outside your organisation. They're levels of performance that another organisation has achieved for, for that same performance measure that you're interested in. Benchmarks from organisations that represent world's best practice or industry best practice can become targets that you use for your performance measures. Because others have achieved that level of performance, it is so much easier to conceive that you can too. So what is a performance target? Well, a target is defined from dictionary.com as a, um, a person, object or place that's selected as the aim of an attack. <laughs> I'm not super keen on using the word attack, so I would adapt this definition um, to be a performance target as a level of performance we're aiming to reach in the future. In the future is a really important qualifier. To shift a baseline performance level to a targeted performance level, it takes time and it takes effort to redesign the underlying business processes, uh, the skills, the capabilities, whatever so that the whole system is now capable of better performance. Now, if you tell everyone to work harder to hit target every month, you're just compensating for a process that isn't capable and it will burn everyone out before too long. So what is a performance standard? Again, from dictionary.com, a generic definition of the word standard is a level of quality or attainment. For example, when we make a promise to our customers to fix their problem within two days, 95% of the time, then the standard for our performance measure becomes two days. It means that we want to see our performance measures values for um, days to fix problems to be under two days in at least 95% of cases. Now, just because you have a standard does not mean your business processes are capable of meeting it. Part of performance improvement is to design our processes to make them capable of meeting any standards. So standards are similar to targets, but they apply here and now. You've, you've made a promise to your customers and you want to monitor how well you're keeping that promise. So which of these terms are used in your organizational business? And 
How well are they defined and discerned from each other so that people don't get confused? If you have any examples or stories to share or you want to ask a question about this topic, I'd love to hear from you in the comments.